We've discussed viruses as well as prions and viroids, and we're going to go ahead and do some examples to review this material. Example one, describe the steps involved in the reproduction of a virus by the lytic cycle. Remember that the first step of infection via the lytic cycle is attachment of the virus to the host cell. And that is mediated by specific proteins on the surface of the virus and receptors on the surface of the host cell. Once the virus is attached, the virus injects its DNA into the host cell. The next thing is that the virus produces an enzyme that degrades the host cell DNA. So a viral enzyme degrades host DNA. After that, the virus uses the host cell's machinery to replicate. Viral DNA and proteins produced using the host cell machinery. So capsid proteins would be produced, any other proteins that the virus has packaged within the capsid, also copies of the genetic material, the viral genome are made. After that, the virus particles self-assemble. So the DNA is placed inside the capsid, any different parts of the capsid that need to come together do, and then a viral enzyme lyses the bacterial cell. The viral enzyme lyses the host cell, and virus particles are released. These viral particles, the offspring of the original virus, are then free to go ahead and infect another cell. So this is the lytic cycle.